Carter. For the past five seasons, Madison native Logan Stenberg has been perfecting his craft with the University of Kentucky football team. And during his senior year, he was able to make the All-SEC squad. Well, over the weekend, Stenberg was able to achieve his childhood dream of being selected in the NFL draft. Our very own Kayla Carlisle takes a look back at Logan's roots and also talk with the guy who coached him in high school. Five years ago, head coach Wade Waldrop was doing what he does just about every day at James Clemens High School. Fast forward to today, and now he's reminiscing on his time working with a young man who was ready to make it big and refers to himself as Mr. Nasty. I mean, it's preached. You know, uh, we, we, we want our linemen and our offensive linemen to have an aggressive nature about them. Being aggressive is just one skill required to use on the gridiron. That skill helped former James Clemens standout Logan Stenberg land a scholarship at the University of Kentucky. And now, a spot with the Detroit Lions. They want to finish a block. They're, they're going at the beginning of the whistle, and then they're finishing at the echo of the whistle. He's just been the biggest one and most physical when we've had that way. Coach Waldrop didn't get the chance to coach Logan all four years, but in their short time together, Coach says the six foot six guard made quite the impression. Tons of personality. I mean, a great kid. You know, teachers liked him, administrators liked him. He, he's fun to talk to when he comes back. But no, no, no aggressive issues okay. off the field. It was all on the field. Now the two get to look forward to a new chapter, one that will challenge Logan and also bring some light into Coach Waldrop's life. You know, I'm sure those guys up there are going to go back and read everything the guy's ever said, and I'm sure everything <laughs> he's ever said or done, there's going to be, you know, he's going to get checked on it, and he's going to get called out on it, and um, I would love to be at those practices and watch those early practices as he's getting challenged by you know, by those professional athletes and, and just seeing how that goes. I think, I think it's going to be really interesting. So Stenberg is headed to Detroit to make his dreams finally come true. While he's there, he'll be reunited with a few other Tennessee Valley natives, such as Bob Jones alum, Reggie Raglan, of course, Madison Academy alum, Carrion Johnson, and of course, we can't forget the Columbia alum, Trey Flowers. In Huntsville, I'm Kayla Carlisle, WZDX Sports.